Here we are in my garage once again with another mini bike. I picked this up on YouTube, not on YouTube. I picked it up on Facebook Marketplace for a hundred bucks. It's pretty rough, but we can work with it. It needs the carburetor clean. It runs like crap. It needs brakes and a brake lever. Bottle cable is good. The tires are decent. Ish. Um. Front fender bolted back on. Clutch is seized up on the engine. Crankshaft, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. So, that's what we're doing today. Getting this one functional as it is. No modifications. Also, we'll probably change the oil and that's probably about it. Put some gas in it. Go. So, let's go ahead and get started. And the first thing we're going to tackle is this here clutch issue. Is that better? Good. So, I already sprayed this with PB Blaster and it's been soaking for 30 ish minutes. So, I'm going to tap this the wrong direction a couple times. Be careful not to hit the crankshaft. Just till I can see it move a little bit. So I know it's not completely frozen. Now I'm gonna take this here ball joint fork and stick it right in here. Now don't get too crazy with this because you can crack this aluminum side cover. And we might do that today, but we're gonna try not to. Now our ball joint fork is bottomed out. So I'll be right back. So bam, I'm back. The camera died, but all I did was put this wedge back here, down here on the thin side, drive it down again, take it out, move the wedge over a little bit, drive it down again, move it over, drive it down again. So now we're at this point right here, so now I'm just hitting back on this top part. My guy is close to coming off here. So, the next task will be to be very careful. Oh, look, it's already on me. Alright, so, bolt head. Gotta get that out. So, I got this freaking can of brake clean. The thing broke off right there. <laughs> Use it for something, right? Take a little wire brush. Fill in your rough spots, which I do have. We'll clean them up with a file before you put your new clutch on. We're gonna get this bolt out real quick. Maybe. Wires. Handy dandy specialty MIG pliers here. All right, so I got a nut. I'm gonna hold it a little bit to the back, like so. Let me build it up a little bit right here in the center. And I'm going to hit it with that wire brush again. Let it cool off. And maybe we got it the first shot. Maybe we didn't. Tap, tap, tap a room. Got another nut, and we'll try it again. Damn it. I'm going to cool all the way down this 
Это Don't come over now. It ain't coming up. Okay, cool. There it is. Looks like it was cross-threaded. So, the lesson for today is if at first you don't succeed, Try and try again. But this was my last attempt. <laughs>